it is disgusting looking. What's good YouTube? Today we're back with a little bit of updates for the tadpoles. And so we are actually seeing a lot of little froglets around and it's crazy how fast they became little frogs. So I, I figured I'd show you guys how they look now that they're little froglets and we're gonna be releasing them soon. Now, as the weeks followed from the first video, I encountered a little monster. It was quite disgusting once I found it and I have kept it on the side. But let me show you what it is first. So I was looking through my old video, my latest video, I mean, and I saw this little creature in the video along the tadpoles that was eating a worm. And I was like, what the heck is that? <laughs> I didn't realize it was there until I saw the video. But um, I went out to look for it in the tadpoles uh, cage and I realized there's way less tadpoles. And I'm like, oh my gosh, what, what if this thing started eating tadpoles? And I freaking found a demigorgon. <laughs> this right here is what I found. And that tadpole that's missing a tail was being eaten when I found him. It was gorging on that. And this thing has grown like five times the size it was in the video. It's been like a week and this thing is already this big isn't that insane <laughs> and it's gorging on my tadpoles you can see that poor little thing is probably gonna die <laughs> here's a better view of him it is disgusting looking the stuff of nightmares and when he eats god it's gross he doesn't want to eat in front of me though like i mean i've seen him eat uh from far away but once i get close he stops eating and like does that <laughs> now that that fluke has been taken out of the way um this is the tadpoles that we have left and like i said in the first video we have different species now it's confirmed <laughs> and we have also different stages of life it looks like there's some that are that have the legs some that are froglets already and some that are still too small to develop any Limp. But these are the ones we have left after that Demogorgon ate everything uh, in its path. So thankfully, there's still quite a few left, but it definitely took a toll on the number that we had in here. As for the tadpoles, this is one of the things I fed these guys. It was at the time a dead lizard that I found outside, and it looks squished. So I think it died from being squished by something, therefore, I didn't think it was. It died from like a pesticide or something. So I fed them this dead lizard and I thought it was amazing to see the leftovers and just how much these guys can eat. Like, look at that. That's a little, little cranium. That is a hip and a spine. And these guys were able to eat it. So their diet consisted of many things like that. Um, dead insects that I found or boiled egg caught into little tiny pieces they ate it too they ate um, uh, boiled lettuce we gave them many different things and they really liked all of it all of them did good and I think that keeping the berry like that was really healthy for them maybe that's why they grew so fast I kind of moved around the setup so that there would be more of a hiding spot here because it was facing the light and it would have not being much of a hide and so if we look closely there he is <laughs> so that's kind of what all of the other froglets look like except for one which has a lot of spots and it looks really different from this guy so I think we have different species I think it's safe to say most of them are tree frogs though they look like tree frogs to me and there's a lot of tree frogs here in Florida so whoop like I mentioned in the first video, we want to make sure that these guys have a chance at life. So we'll be releasing them soon. And we might wait for a lot more to become froglets. But we'll be releasing them and we will be, uh, you know, ending our little experiment. 
So it looks like it's about to storm, so it is the perfect time to release these guys. As you can see, right there is a huge lake. So this is the perfect area, especially where, because there is already so many little tree frogs around here. So yeah, this is what this is what um, I captured all these guys for. Be free! <laughs> I think it's cute. Oh, Gonzo. That's all I got for you today. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. It really helps me know what kind of stuff you guys like and what you don't. If you also like the stuff that I do and you want to see more of the more of this, please subscribe. Uh, it really helps out as well. If you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them in the comments down below. I always check on them. And I thank you so much for watching this video once more. Goodbye.